uh, as long with uh, Christian Trajewski, while uh, Ahmed Yusuf, sorry, Yusuf Ahmed and Stefan Zinni will look to grab the goals in attack. And we are now underway. Blue versus white. Avondale, the home side in blue. The cannons in all white. Rika Bene. Chris passing by Avondale. Diaz to Trojeski. Moving into those half spaces. Christian Trojeski and he's firing the first shot in anger of the afternoon and it's off target. Spot kick, but oh, perhaps a subdued shout of that. Diaz has really come to life early in this one. Trojeski again. Goes to ground again. Whilst he managed to block that one away, but only as far as Stefan Zinni. So the attack continues for Avondale. To Koopy for Towns. Towns with the dummy. And Carpenter. Another effort on goal for Avondale. It's the Lions share of possession with Avondale as we expected. Katavian. Katavian tries his luck. And Janik left back is going to come the other way. Oh, a little bit of a careless touch by Ahmed, but he receives it again. Zinni. Still he goes. Stefan Zinni with the strike. As Zinni is charging down that right-hand side. Ball floated in. It's repelled well by Williams. Zinni again. And it's a chance for Towns to blast from distance off the crossbar. You say Towns. What a strike that was. Deserved a goal. Machini in support. Pressure from Diaz was good for Avondale. And here's Daniel Clark getting in behind. And somehow that's not gone in for Daniel Clark. Scott Options arriving at the back post. And this is a chance for Decker on the turn. The first touch was great and the finish wasn't quite up to the same standard. Williams and Clark and Dylan will be the targets, but it's not his best effort. Yusuf Ahmed. Trojeski. Back to Ahmed. And he finds the back of the net. Yusuf Ahmed. Set up by a familiar source in Christian Trojeski. And Yusuf Ahmed. Filling the boots of the likes of Liam Boland and Manny Agwek, who aren't there today. Puts his hand up. And it continues as well. Well, they need to be careful here, Jakupi, because... Guest is coming forward and his shot was, well, it was almost in slow motion there as Yonkman went full stretch and didn't get a touch. In by the left footer and Avondale can't make the clearance. Williams on the volley. What a goal that would have been by the central defender. And Avondale going to come away again. Well, that was a good idea and Feely was well out off his line there. Dylan and space for Fashini. Diaz had to close down. Vashini gets his cross in well. Holmes was the target. He's got a touch on the header. Knowles. It's a crowded penalty area. It's a good ball for Clark though. And Holmes! Second goal in the week for Tyson Holmes. And what a great build up it was. Perfect ball by Joe Knowles. And then played back across the goal intelligently by Daniel Clark. Made it. And that indeed is the last action of the first half. Topolis. Ahmed now. Trajeski laying it out wide for Zinni. Flag goes up. And the ball hit the side netting anyhow. Good headaches there for the Cannons defence as this ball comes in. And it's a great save from Yonkerman to deny Wade Decker. Well, from one end to the other. Not a good week to be on laundry duty. In by Knowles. Away again by Yonkerman with the two fifths. The lanky Dutchman providing the cover. And again he gets his hands on it and it's turned in. And the goal is given for the Cannons. 2-1 they lead. Avondale don't like it. But it's going to stand. Knowles charging down the right hand side. Joe Knowles. Gets around Carpenter with ease. It's Knowles! Side netting. Forward by Dylan, who's Clark, and it came off Clark while well, he wasn't actually facing the ball. And Decker with the shot. And familiar two handed it. 
Driven in by Knowles. Brought down by Williams. In his own advantage. And what a goal that is by Aaron Williams. Both central defenders are on the score sheet now for Oakley. And they're just about out of sight. And the technique and the execution by Aaron Williams. He's been allowed a lot of license on his right-hand side. That's a good ball for Ahmed. On the byline, cuts it back. Oh, it was so close because Milos Marinkovic was in there. The youngster couldn't get a decisive touch. Clark's header. And this is a race. And I'm going to enjoy watching here as the guest and Hillier. Guess he's going to float it in to the back post area. And Knowles! He seals the deal for the Cannons. What a good place to get to go to in the middle of July. But that, for now, is it for the day because it is the Oakley Cannons getting the win to take back to Jack Edwards Reserve. The three points, four goals to go with it as well. And it was really a stellar second-half performance by them.